Hello. We're back with more Soma. I I don't I don't feel like I'm mentally ready, but you know what we got? We got a pot of tea. And uh hopefully the warmth of the beverage will help. We'll see. You just got a soda stream ad. That's incorrect. This is a Soma stream. You're right. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't want to press X to continue. Okay. I guess... Is there any, like, life updates I can give? How is everyone's Halloween? I hope everyone had a fabulous weekend. Happy Tuesday. I didn't do much for Halloween. I... Halloween's like usually my favorite holiday, right? But this year, uh, just with, you know, COVID, there wasn't a whole lot to do. So I just stayed at home and played with makeup. Next year, right? But we can continue the Halloween of vibes with Soma. <laughs> so that's where we're at. Arco, I hope you're doing good. Hope you're doing well. I'm stalling. I'm stalling a lot. It, the game takes forever to load, so at least it'll stall for me a little bit. So, where we left off from last stream... We're in, like, this submerged shuttle. Um, large ship. Yeah, Simon found a wreck at the- a large ship at the bottom of the sea. That's nice that it gives a little recap there, but yeah. We're, like, exploring this ship, and I just, like- I've seen most of the game before, if not all of it, but this is- from here onward, I don't really remember the gameplay itself. Um... But I do remember that there is a part like this with a monster. And I, so I think it's just this area. But that's where we're at. I mean, you know what? I'm gonna I'm gonna turn my phone on silent. Allie! Allie, thank you so much for the resub. Uh let me let me finish muting this. Alright, good. It is muted. My phone won't, like, buzz in the middle of this and freak me the fuck out. Allie, how are you doing? Thank you so much for the resub. Oh, can't believe it's been eight months. Eight months since I started streaming. Holy cow. All right. <laughs> Push the button. Where the fuck are we? Is this where we came in? This doesn't even look like where we came in. Maybe it is. I'm gonna turn... Already turning the headphones down. Let me know how the volume is, as always, but it's it looks okay over here. There's... I forget, there's no flashlight. Saving. Great. Good. I'm glad to know that getting from that side of the room to this side of the room was a check part, checkpoint. Does this open? Oh, I'm crouched. I forget. Oh, it goes this way. Okay. I wish I could turn on my flashlight! You know what? Maybe crouching was a good idea. There was something there. There was something there. How do I lean? Let's run. How do I lean? How do I lean? Shit. I thought it was this button. But it's- oh, there it is. Alright, it's- 
R1. Okay. Oh, yep. Is it coming towards us or away from us? hear it this is so much <laughs> this is oh i'm not good at this oh my god these are all open rooms <gasps> there it is there it is I'm, I'm a baby, all right? I never watched horror movies growing up. I, I never did. What the? What's this? What were you trying to get me to pick up? Is it important? Uh, I don't like when stuff moves. Oh, it's just, it's fine. It's just stuff that I can touch. This is just a hide room, got it. There's nothing to do in here. Are you sure this isn't the end of the puzzle? The very first room on the left? Okay. Lean with it, rock with it. How? I don't actually know how y'all play horror games like for fun. <gasps> oh. Dear Lord. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Don't come. Ah! Uh, he can't see me, I'm staring at the wall. I like I'm too afraid to turn. You know, if you're going to kill me, just kill me. I'd rather just die and start over. What the fuck? Are you in the room or not? I don't know where I'm supposed to go right now, which does not help. Pika, hello! We're having a rough time. I'm having a rough time. Yeah, good to see you again. Oh, sorry. Are Sorry if you're hearing that with my uh, my PC. I don't know why it's making that noise. I'm like wondering if I should be opening and closing doors, but I kind of want it to be able to fully roam. Oh my god, if this is... Oh, thank god. I thought it was a dead end. It is a dead end. God damn it.
Harvey, now is not the time. <laughs> yeah, like I hear the monster and I see the screen stuff, but I don't know when it's actually near me. So it's hard to like avoid. I have to let Harvey out. He's he's going to he's gonna freak me out. He's just at the door and he's just he's meowing. He has been kicked out. The door has been closed. He is not welcome back at this time. Pika, you gotta run. No worries at all. Thank you so much for stopping by. Have a good sleep. Let's have some tea. We'll collect ourselves. I should have added a pause counter. Um, I do have a, a, like a scream counter, which you can use for... I don't know. I feel like most of the time I just go, ah, <laughs> like I don't really scream, but it's close enough, right? I, um, I, I am going to try to get through the game. I can't say whether or not I'm going to enjoy it. I'm going to, this is, this is a Halloween skit that went too long. Oh. I wish it wouldn't do that unless I was looking at the thing, you know? Like, it's it's too many false alarms. It is also just so dark. try to get some sleep after watching this yeah like i don't know if it was the coffee or uh the coffee or the game but when i played this the first night i was up until like 2 or 3 a.m just like laying in bed just staring at the ceiling oh there he is I don't really know. All right. Just ignore me. I'm looking at the wall. You can't see me. I'm looking at the wall. Where am I supposed to go, though? He's in that room. We're not going to look. I feel like it's supposed to be this way. So we went in that room, we've gone down that way. Did we go this way? Oh, this is new. Can we close the door? That's the first door I've wanted to close. You know what? Yeah, I'll touch the goop. Uh. Not crazy about that. Loopy, hello. Quite juicy. <laughs> yeah, I would put our whole fist in there, yeah. Ugh. Don't come in here, man. I'm standing right in front of the door, but you can't see me. I'm not looking at the door. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I will move. We're good. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. You just keep moving. All right, we're gonna just go left. Just don't look and just go left. Bridge, hi! Oh my god. Everyone's coming in to watch me suffer. Which is what's happening, by the way. This is this is this is rough. Oh, 
Wait, the music got nicer. The music got nicer. We did it. We just had to go around. Okay, all right. Whew. Can, was there a door back here? Can I close a door? Can I just... Nope. All right. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Uh... Move. Right trigger. Excuse me. Why? Ah! No! Thank you! He doesn't- he doesn't seem to chase all that much, which is kind of cool. He follows. so much for the follow. That didn't need to be so aggressive. We didn't have to, like, yank that open. How much do we know about the antagonist here? Oh, and, uh, Kim's playing your game redemption. So you give the second monitor alert. Thanks, Bridge. I appreciate that. Yeah, no, if, if someone's playing a game that you voted for, you better be there, right? <laughs> but thanks for the lurk. I appreciate it. Sorry, I'm, I'm bad at chat because I'm so hyper-focused on this goddamn creature. Um, and what do we know about, about this thing? Not a whole lot. Mostly... Mostly we just know that... Um, there's this weird kind of goop that gives robots some form of consciousness, it seems like. Um, but I don't know too much about the alien thing. Oh, we got another Heidi room. That's nice. All right, we'll wait for him to walk by and then we'll go back out and we'll try to turn the thing again. I'm not sure why it wasn't turning. Why are we underwater? So we went to go get our brain scanned after an accident. And when we woke up from the brain scan, we were in this underwater place and we didn't know why. Um, so from what we've gathered from the game so far is that we're actually like several hundred years in the future. Um, and all of society on earth has like collapsed and the only people that were left were on this base that has a um an arc they call it an arc oh god damn it um they call it an arc that uploads everybody's brains basically to a computer and then we're trying to shoot the computer into space That is that is the story so far. Oh, oh! Did you see that? That's freaky. What a freaky dude. Yeah, the Matrix. The Matrix, but it's the only option. Wait, is he just going back and forth? What's the deal? Can we not stay here? Do we have to keep moving? I'm confused. Sir? Ugh. Sir, sir. You hired... You hired a mechanic. We're here to do your mechanic work. But you need... I need you to leave. The 
the magic coming out of a cat scan machine. The doctor's saying, thanks, we own you now. <laughs> I don't know. I swear, sometimes it lets me lean, and other times it just doesn't. Why can't... I don't know why I can't turn this. I don't understand what, what the deal is. Am I not allowed to turn it yet? Like... I can do that just fine, right? Oh, it's fish. Look at the fishies. Oh no, it's grass. I'm not describing the American healthcare system. <laughs> Yeah, they already do that with the outrageous medical bills. Welcome to America. Also, I've got a rant. I have a rant. I, uh... Maybe I can't turn this yet. Maybe this is stuck. Oh, there it goes. Oh my god, let me up! Let me up! Oh my god, why can't I try it? Go up the ladder! Thank you! Oh, saving! Oh yeah, saving. Oh my god. Alright, so I have a rant. Is he down there? Okay. He's definitely up here now, that's how video games work. He teleports. Um... So, uh, 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 a couple years ago, I made a mistake when I was using whatever it was, TurboTax, to file my taxes. Like, I put a form in the wrong spot or something um, because I'm not an accountant. And I got hit with a crazy bill for the IRS to, to fix it, right? So I, not wanting to pay this huge bill, um, hired an accountant and got it fixed. Had to pay a hefty fee for the accountant to get it fixed. But it was less than I would have had to have paid the IRS. So got that resolved. I ended up owing the IRS uh, $14 for one tax year and $0 for the other. So not bad. Um, then I got a letter in the mail that it hadn't been resolved. Uh, and oh, I'm gonna finish my story. I got a letter in the mail that it hadn't been fixed and that I was inquiring interest and that it was gonna go to collections or something like that. Um, so I like called my accountant. I was like, what the fuck? And he was like, IRS lost it. You mailed it off. They didn't get it. So I had to get a tax advisor that is like one of the departments of the IRS to be my advocate and prove that I did submit my taxes, resubmit them a third time, and um, I had to have my accountant fax the information over to the tax advocate. And then um, I got a, a nice like $200 bill from the accountant for, file, for uh, sending a fax. I was like, thanks, man. Thanks for, thanks for the help, accountant. Must be nice making $400 an hour. Jesus Christ. If I had known, I would just file it myself. <laughs> that is my... Uh, oh, and by the way, it fixed one of my years. Totally fine. I got a letter in the mail. It's like, you owe zero. And I was like, yay. I did like a whole thing. It was like, I like, got I, I got cake. Um, it was I was so excited. The other year, it says I owe $15, which I already paid when I originally submitted. And uh, at this point, I'm just going to pay the $15. i am just like, I can't. I can't do it anymore. 
taxes be like tell us how much you owe us we already know we want you to say it yeah i was like come on for the love of god all right sorry about my rant there i just like just got that letter in the mail before starting the stream this is much better let's see if we can't get this thing moving uh oh wait what safety locks are blocking the vessel's release are you kidding how much more of an emergency could this ship be in it's on the bottom of the sea take a look at the engine room and see if you can figure it out maybe there's an override or something there's monsters out there like the ones we saw at lambda he's way too to calm about going. that what come on you know the drill don't look at them or get too close it'll mess with your circuits oh shit we need to get out of here i know i know i'm going all right. Something is stabilizing the ship. We need to let it know this is an emergency. So we need to go to the engine or whatever room. Do we do we know where that is? Did she say it's in Convince like the, ship the basement? This is an emergency. Uh convince the ship. Is there which way did we come? Oh, okay. This seems important. What? What? What is it? Where is it? I didn't see it! I still don't see it. Did it become in- there it is. Oh fuck. Did that just like spawn in there? What the hell? Just don't move, just stay here. It's fine. Man. If anyone had told me I could make $400 an hour being an accountant, by the way, I, uh, I, I would have done it. I would have become an accountant. I don't... What the fuck? It is it must be like right behind me. Oh wow, it's right there. Okay. Sir, please leave. Just don't notice me. I'll just go around. I don't know why it wouldn't just pass me. I'm getting less scared because it hasn't attacked me yet. It hasn't like run at me. It's like if you, if you do the spooky scary things all the time, they stop being spooky. I do really wish I could turn on a, a uh, a flashlight, though. Uh, you considered it for a long time before you went back to teaching, Luth. I, yeah, I, I don't blame. You must have some kind of like passion or something. Um, says the artist. Every time you say accountant, all I can think of that is that Tic Tac song. Uh, TikTok song. I don't even rem I don't know if I recall off the top of my head which one you're talking about. Orc, hello! Ah, I hate it. I like that she says that it's messing with our circuits, and that's why... Did we go back downstairs somehow? I thought we went up. Why are you in here? Why is he just in there all the time? That's where I want to be. Sir. Which way are you going? Left or right? 
don't turn around and go back in, you idiot. Don't tell me I have to chase him out because I that'd make me mad. I made it in. Attention crew, this is your captain speaking. The final efforts to start the combat. Alright, that one's locked. Good. Failed. Impact is imminent. Let's go up here, I guess. There's nothing up here. Great, that's exactly what I wanted. That's what I was thinking. Cool, 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 cool. He teleports. Ah, he teleports! <laughs> That's not fair! What do you mean he teleports? Game! Leave me alone. Come here. Just so you know, the controller is just vibrating. Like, it's just un... Can you, can you hear that? It just doesn't stop. <laughs> I'm just... Uh... It's like you cannot relax. You must restart immediately. Orc, your, uh, your house tour was excellent. It was very cool getting to see the space. I'm I'm very excited to see how you settle into it, into uh, into everything. So, was that where we were supposed to go? Because I'm not sure if it was actually. It kind of seemed like I don't know too dangerous. Let's go this way, I guess. I thought that was where I was supposed to go because he was in there. It seems like everything else is a dead end. Yeah, yeah, it'll work. I'd love to. All right, there's nothing here. Cool. It's just a bathroom. Let's try it this way. Again, there's nothing really in here. The only place that we can go is in this goddamn room. Just stare at the corner. What's annoying is that I Damn it. I can't really like throw things um underwater. It didn't really work. Oh, I'm still in here. Will this work? What if we just stare at the floor and just march to where we need to be? Do you see how wobbly we are? Oh my god. This way? Because I don't think we could come in this door. I think this area was blocked off, right? Ah, staircase! This is new. Okay. 
Okay, we're getting, we're making progress. We're making progress. This isn't that bad though. Like, I think actually if it was more subtle, it would be worse. But because it's so aggressive, like screen interference, like basically all the time, when something does happen, I'm like not as phased by it. Not entirely sure where we are. Good way to describe it. The destruction is absolute. Surface is I don't think this is where we're supposed to be. Oh, sick. Oh, wait, what? Why can't I use the thing? Look at, we're so woozy. Uh, uh, did you show where the future pork tub will be? I assume, yeah, outside, right? Orc, you've got to get, like, a decent one, though. Don't get one of the inflatable ones from Amazon. Even though the price is more approachable, you got to get a good one. You don't want one that's going to break on you after a year. This is house advice from someone who doesn't have a house. <laughs> so you can take everything I say with a grain of salt. But it seems to me like something that would be worth it. Actually, my dad used to have a hot tub in his basement. Um... It was, like, it built into the foundation of the house when he bought it. And, uh, it was cool for, like, a couple of years. But then it short-circuited. Which was scary. It, like, caught fire. This seems like where we're supposed to be. Grabbing something to eat? Sounds good, Allie. Pork tub sounds like something else. It sure does. But that's the fun of it. Hey, loading. Maybe we did make it where we're supposed to go. I'm fine. I'm doing okay. I'm doing okay. But I swear, it's going to start us right at the running, isn't it? Oh, no. We have to do the whole thing again. Okay. I did not memorize the way to get out of here. Man, it feels like it's lagging a lot, and I don't know if it's the, um, I don't know if it's the game. So we went down this way. We went straight. Here. 
Where the fuck am I? It's like, man, it's it's too fast for me to figure out where I'm supposed to go and what I'm supposed to do. I don't like running chasing sequences. Not not a fan, not a fan. All right, we'll try again. We'll try again. Maybe I should like go back and look really quick before I pull those to like see the path instead of just trying to luck into it. I can do that. I can backtrack for just like a quick second. Now that I know that this is where a monster is. So, from what I remember, we came up this way. I thought we went, man, my PS4 is lagging though. That is annoying. I don't know why. Let's get this open in advance. And then it's straight down that way, okay. So hopefully that stays open. Let's try it again, we'll try again. We should name our little aquarium friend here. We should name him something silly, like Bubbles. I like Bubbles, seems fitting. take him too seriously, it'll make it easier. Alright, get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Take a left, down, down. Can we close the door? Fuck, you can't close the door? That's not fair. I was trying to plan ahead. You can't close the goddamn door. All right. What is it, fourth time's the charm? I'm just, I don't know when he stops chasing. That's my question, right? Like, also is this? Oh, okay. I was like, do I have a dead pixel on this monitor? I would be so upset. There's just something on it. Okay, all right, hold up. So we're trying to just get back to Catherine, right? Oh, I'm sorry if you guys can see that lag. I should, man, get out of the way. Close, open the store in advance. I guess I could just go down that one, but whatever. So we go down, we go down, right? So then we were here. open this door, and then I think this is where the other dude is. Or, or was. Okay. Oh! Interesting. So that one I just can't touch. I guess I just can't close doors behind me. Just a little bit off-putting. I'm just not gonna worry about it. I'm gonna assume I'm not supposed to close doors.
You know what, let's leave this one for last so we'll be a little bit further away. Thing. All right, here we go. I did it. Allie, you wouldn't believe it. It was bullshit. There was a part of the game where we had to flip some switches and then run. <laughs> and he chased us. It took a couple of attempts, but we made it. Can you steer this thing? Starboard rotor is choking, but I can compensate. How do you even know what direction we're going in? Don't worry, I'm hooked up to the navigator. We're headed for Theta. Should be a matter of minutes. I thought I was done for back there. Seems like the WoW was keeping the Curie from going into a catastrophic failure state. I, I mean, how did it get on the ship? Are you talking about the black tentacles in the engine room? I've seen them before at Upsilon. What are they? They're a manifestation of a malfunctioning station-wide artificial intelligence called the WoW. Station-wide? So we just made a powerful enemy. No, no, it's not like that. The AI isn't a persona. It doesn't feel or think like we do. It's more like, uh, it's more like a cancer. Was that the ship? Looks like your sabotage worked better than expected. Brace for impact! Uh -huh. Hold on, the blast just pushed us off the plateau! What does that mean? If I don't hit Delta, we're dead. We're getting chased by robot cancer. It's interesting. Oh, nice. They notified a rescue team. We're going to be okay, you guys. We're going to be all right. We're going to pull through. If we just wait long enough, someone will come for us. It's always can't. It is an indie game. <laughs> Check. I should make a bingo card. You know what? We should have a bingo card for every indie game. Sir, please stand. You're a robot. Your legs are fine. What else would be on that indie game bingo card? What the hell? Why can't I move? Never get it open. What? Oh, oh. I'm so disoriented. All right. Oh, it's our friend. But what else would be in that bingo card? There'd have to be car crashes on the bingo card. There'd have to be, um, Oh, hey, little guy. Didn't expect to see you again. Uh... Don't worry, Kat. I'll find a way to Theta. Can we follow our little, ro our little robot? Roguelikes? Yep. That would, that would be on the bingo card, for sure. Um... Some kind of plotline about mental health. That it... It's in a lot of indie games these days. Um, hand-drawn art style. Uh, 
Although now we're just kind of talking about games. What's that up there? Jump. What's that say? What's it say? I'm gonna brainstorm it though. I'm gonna make a bingo card because now I want this. All right. I got sidetracked by just kind of following other stuff. We should follow the lights. So. Allie, we're done playing hide and seek. We got away from the monster. What's this? This area is very pretty, I'll say. Control room. Well, it's in, it's in rough shape. Can we get in there, though? Doesn't really look like there's much in there for us. I can't tell if this guy is just following us or leading us. Am I right? Can't believe how much I'm sweating oh. in this suit. Hi. Hey, could you maybe help? I need to get the Theta. Help me out here, will you? I think I need some vacation soon. Have to speak with Acres about that. Isn't that right, Acres? You're not much help. Look at him, he looks like Wally. Yeah. Hey, can you hear me? Make yourself useful. Listen. Help me out here, will you? You help me. We can help each other. Did you move the cartridge casing? We need to test that. What do these say? Theta? Zeppelin transport Theta. There's Zeppelins? Oh! Oh, he had a rough day. Ah, oh, poor guy. Are there real people in there? So far we've only found... Uh... Oh, there was this guy too. Um... The robots that are swimming around generally know. Um... The... Like, our character is a... Oh, thanks, buddy. Our character is a human brain uploaded into a robot. Um, it's possible that there's like a guy Good in that robot. other robot, but we don't know. Oh, we got another arm goop. Stick our whole arm in there. Gross. Uh, K8, UH8, Intelligence Complex, Class, Light Universal Helper, Remote Pilot, Not Applicable, Note, while the K8, um, Kate? I think it's Kate, right? While the Kate is uh, lacks a voice module, is able to communicate by simplified sounds and lights. That's so cute. Bull. Oh, so this is Wally. Okay. Intelligence complex. Medium worker. Remote pilot supported. So maybe you can upload a brain to this one. Yeah, I want a little baby robot too. Topa. Complex, mini, UH, remote pilot not applicable, intelligence basic, Kualia, RV2, research vessel, remote pilot mandatory. Note, this vessel has basic intelligence only. A pilot is needed to fully utilize this equipment. Messages. 
from Theta, Subject Delta, Evacuation. Terry, it's been decided that you and your crew will evacuate to Theta on the 14th. Everything is being taken care of, and you will be given all, uh, you will all be given new positions as you arrive. You will have to fall uh, into the ranks, of course. The last thing we need is more leaders. Subject, it's your funeral. Fuck you. <laughs> Not going anywhere. What's that, Cronstead? Uh, I'm not going anywhere. You don't have the authority to make me, Terry. Uh, this isn't my orders, you idiot. I'm just the messenger. You don't want to stay? Uh, you want to stay? I can I can buy you some time if you want to hang out at your dump, but your crew is moving tomorrow. Mr. Ackers, I'm happy to inform you that your crew has safely arrived at Theta. Let me know when you are ready to move, and I'll send a transport. Peter. Merry Christmas, Ackers. Don't hesitate to ask if you want to be relocated to Theta. Allie, you gotta take off. Thanks for hanging out, Allie. I'll catch you later. Have a good night. Thanks for thanks for stopping by. I wish I could write emails like that. Can you imagine? Like, no more of this, uh, uh just, um, the passive-aggressive, um, the regards, just regards, right? <laughs> uh, so wait, nope, go back down. Back. Access log. Terry won his thousandth game of chess. Out of how many, I wonder. Chess. Oh, no. Oh, good. <laughs> Games. 1,600. Lost. Lost uh, 600. That's actually really good. 1,001, 600 lost. That's, that's pretty good. <laughs> Saved! Yeah. Believe me, I did not want to play chess on stream. It would be bad. Chess is not my uh, chosen game. Oh, it's a bathroom. Oh, shit, there's a map. So right now we're in... Delta, right? Theta is just like in the middle there, I guess. Wait, what? Oh, I found the flashlight. Oh, shit. Never turning this off. All right, so I, I guess we just have to go like across this way. I'm just gonna keep following signs. This looks like something that's working. What's this? Cool. Oh, oh, I see. Channel one. I guess I should let it load. Man, you can really tell when Astrid is off platform. This place turns into such a locker room. Not in a good way either. This is gonna take so long to actually scan for stuff. Even when women aren't around, you know? What if we just go to the yellow one? You're so full of shit, Brandon. I've seen you when payload manager Alice Coster shows up. You let her manage your payment? Why? That doesn't even make sense. Link established what? What? Forget it, Akers. I'm not playing with you anymore. As if chess wasn't boring enough. You just have to go and win in four moves or whatever. Where the fuck are we? I don't even know if this is where I want to be. But I found a door. Whew. 
I didn't expect it to open so quickly. I need to save them from this hell. Lock them in the lucid dreams I've seen. Our reflection the black blood of our warden whispers. Ugh. I do like that there's no pickups in this game. Like, I don't have to worry about keeping track of the lamp oil. I'm excited... I'm excited. It's exciting to watch WoW claim Delta. Half a year ago, I'd be worried I'd have Goya and Wong clean the black blood from the machinery. Now its crusty surfaces seem um, complement, even outside, even outshine what Delta was. So this guy just like went kind of crazy in here playing chess, huh? The light is hurting my eyes. He's telling me I don't need this mistress flesh inside my skull to see salvation. I will gladly remove them, stop them from obs obfuscating. I haven't seen that word before. Uh, this divine mission. If you play chess, you're already crazy. <laughs> if you play chess like super competitively, I'm like, props. It's that's rough. What do we got here? Oh, I got a deck of cards. All right. Well, this was a nice little side area. Let's go. <laughs> wander around a little bit more. Let me out. Let me out. Open the door. Alright, so we just went in this Did way. Did you so. move the outer shields? No, the same one. The healer. Yeah, yeah. Let's go I down know. here and it's follow the lights. Never mind. I found it. I wonder how far you could just, like, wander before the game stopped you. And I wonder, like, when the game stopped you, would it, like, just be a monster that just insta-kills you? Or would you actually hit an invisible wall? I bet it would be a monster. It's a Kate. Oh, can we go up here? Can. I, I feel pretty conscious right now. I don't think I need to touch the weird thing. Alright, so we're still in... Oh, this whole area is... Delta. Oh, so we want to go back to that landing platform that we were on. Okay, so we were on the right track when we were over there. We just didn't commit to that direction. Okay. It looks like there's another room down there that we might be able to check out. Come in, Strasky. Can you hear me? Theta, listen. Acres is headed for Theta. Rough. 
What's this thing? Oh, it looks like blood. Ah, I see it was the last one. I like these little lore areas where we're learning more about the rest of the crew. Or at least how they died, I guess. Hey, buddy. So I think we just want to go straight across here, pretty much. If I recall correctly. Ah, this, this, this aesthetic is really cool. Like, these environments just, like, are so interesting. Control room. Okay, so this is, like, kind of where we started, and then it was over this way, right? Oh, that was that little room that we went to. More robots. Oh, that's not a robot. Oh, this is a whole thing I can press. I'm, I'm just astounded that any of the computers work. Shipping. Zeppelins. Transport active. Unspecified cargo. A Zeppelin's on its way. Better get ready. It is? Wait, really? Did I... Oh my god, I actually called the Zeppelin. the Zeppelin. What? That's so cool. I thought we were going to walk. This is so neat. I should stop playing on the terrain. I don't want to accidentally. That's over here. Calm down, <laughs> we're safe. Oh, it's really disconcerting popping in and out of existence like that. Where are we now? Delta. At least that's what you said before the crash. Oh, right. Of course, is this a Zeppelin? Appropriately named. You think it can get us to Theta? It's a cargo transport. They use them for moving materials between the sites, anything that's too big for the shuttles. I'm sure it can carry us. Ugh, why well, won't it work? Come on. Oh, the tool chip is bust. Isn't that part of the Omni tool? Look who's been paying attention. Ah. Let's deal with that back at Upsilon. Then you know how it works. We need to get a new tool chip and switch it. Care to point me in the direction of the closest tool chip storage? I think it would be easier to just take one from a robot. What? Just knock a robot over the head and steal their chips. The toolbox over there says it has a stun baton. You could use that. Come on. I don't want to hurt anyone. Isn't this a bit much? It's just a robot, Simon. We're just robots. Sort of. I'll get us a chip. We gotta murder one of the robots? I have no choice. Which which robot are we gonna murder? Oh, not the Kate. Where's uh what about the other one? You guys, which robot do we murder? I feel like if we leave the Kate behind, it'll be... Oh, here's the other guy. Like, this guy feels like if we leave it, it'll be like leaving a dog and then moving across the country, right? You just, like, leave the dog on the front step. Horrible. Like, just leaving him behind. He's been following us this whole time. This guy? 
This guy. I love that Delta is such a tight operation. I get to try everything here. This guy just seems like a full-out murder. Like he has a personality yeah, and stuff. Four. Is that the same voice actress as Isaac Clark nice from easy. Dead Space? I don't know. I'm curious though. You guys, which one do we murder? The Kate or the guy with a voice? Hey, try the other one. It's not working. Got it. Looks okay, right? Yeah, it'll do. This one seems like it's less alive. Uh, hey, I'm sorry. Oh, come on. Oh. No, don't run for your life. Good. No, I feel so. <laughs> I'm sorry, come back. Oh. Need the chip. Give me the chip. Psycho streamer kills a robot. <laughs> Buddy, I am so, so sorry. Can we take him with us? Can we have a little funeral? Do I get to keep the stun gun? No, no, take it with us, you idiot. God damn it. Whatever. Thanks, Simon. Don't be mad, okay? We really needed that chip. We'd, we'd be stuck here. Could you do it? Kill a robot like that? I get attached to them too. I'm not a monster. But in this case, it had to be done. Is there a difference between them? I went for the small one. <gasps> no! Not a Kate! Those are so cute! What? <laughs> oh, don't worry. They're dumber than rocks. You're the worst. It's just beginning to sink in. I mean, really sink in. I feel like a monster. I'm a robot. Didn't we cover this already? I guess I've known ever since I woke up at Upsilon. I just keep suppressing it. Like my brain doesn't want me to think about it. It's really getting hard not to think about it. Yeah. Could you maybe hit that switch over there so we could get moving? Oh, yeah, sure. <laughs> Stop with your existential... Hold on. Pause the existential crisis. Hit the go button. You, then you can continue, all right? so cool though man the underwater stuff is is just so neat it's, what's ahead of us what's that oh weird if I uh, if I jump I move or maybe I don't now whatever I can just move around when I'm in the air Oh, saving. Saving. Progress! Whoa. 
Oh, it's like an airplane. We can see where we're going. There, Simon. We got a slight delta detour, but we're back on track. Yeah. We should touch down on a cargo platform just outside Theta. Then we just head inside, grab the dump back, and head down the abyss. 4,000 meters. That's a long way. We don't have to worry, though, because with the dump back, the Ark could have been in the Mariana Trench. It'll hold for anything. That's great. And then... We can start listening to other people when they talk, because that's how conversations work. What? Oh, sorry. I, I just can't stop thinking about what we've become. It's clear that we're no longer human. But then how can I feel like Simon? How can I feel like anything at all? I mean, technically, I don't have any ears, no mouth. Christ, it's a weird thing to think about. I mean, I'm making sounds. I'm still saying things. You sure are. <sighs> okay. Your new body most likely has senses similar to those you had as a human. And your mind, only knowing one way to perceive the world, superimposes that skill set on top of your new features. So my mind is covering it up, pretending nothing's different. If it didn't, you'd probably be incapable of interacting with the world at all. And the stress would either kill you or make you go insane. So I've found a good balance between awareness and ignorance. Does that mean I shouldn't think about this stuff, or are my thoughts actually making me cope? Could I tip the balance by suddenly gaining some insight and then go insane? I wouldn't worry about it. I mean, we have <laughs> real things to deal with. Saving mankind, remember? Speaking of which, we're closing in on Theta. I'll eject the Omnitool. As always, don't forget to take me with you. Uh, okay. Cap, before you go, the artificial intelligence you mentioned in the escape vessel? Uh-huh, yeah, the warden unit, the WoW. Is it the WoW's fault that we're like this? I mean, it seems like something an unreliable AI would do. I suppose it set the ball in motion, but it's not directed with purpose. <laughs> it's really complicated to explain how machines think, Simon. Concentrate on getting inside data, okay? <laughs> Just see you soon. Don't worry about it. Just don't think about it. It's fine. Uh, it is, in fact, not the same voice actor as Isaac Clark, but just found out that they will be keeping the same voice actor for the Dead Space remake. Ooh. That's cool. I might play that. I played a little bit of Dead Space 2, and it was just, like, it was a little jump scary for me, but I remember I made it, like, maybe halfway through the game and then just kind of lost interest. So maybe I should give it another go, especially if they're doing a remake. Strasky, wake up Dr. Masters. We're bringing in anchors. What's wrong? What can I say? Is that a rough day? One of your top series from that era? Damn. What else released around that time? Because Dead Space was like... I don't know. Was Dead Space 2 was like 2012, right? I'm just guessing, though. Maybe it was earlier than that. Maybe it was like 2009? Trying to remember. This thing on? Can everyone hear me? Go ahead, Strom. Listen up. All members. 2011. Of okay, I wasn't far. The art project has caused a lot of arguments the last few months. I'm not going to pretend I understand what the hell Sarang talked about and how his continuity suddenly made sense to kill yourself. For the fucking love of God, or whatever you think is important, don't kill yourself. This place is miserable enough. Don't force your friends to clean up your blood. Rest in peace. Quality. Good? Beautiful, sir. All right, everyone. Show's over. Get back to work. Huh. If you get too far away from this, it won't let you listen. You lost interest about midway through the first? Yeah, I don't remember if I played the first one at all. I don't know if it was just the second one. Thank you, Catherine. Uh, same as the here. Arkham series, Skyrim, OG Dark Souls. There was a lot of good games in that that period of time, huh? Half Life Two, Episode understand. Two, released 2007. Hello. Who is that? Mark. No, we haven't met before. Is this Mark? I think we're safe. Oh, I was so worried something had gone wrong. What's your name? Robin Bass. Theta Field Service Technician. 
Nice to meet you, Robin. Uh, yeah, I had an interesting conversation with some coworkers today where it was like, it was a training about how to like, speak confidently during meetings and not lose in lose people's interest and that kind of stuff um and one of the topics that we had five minutes to prepare a little like mini presentation on uh was the most um culturally significant game of all time and three of us had to like decide on the game and then give a quick little thing about it and we very quickly realized we would not be able to come to a decision about what the most influential game of all time was like it was just way too Hello? divided how did you get here i got scanned like the others and then i killed myself at least i think so wow i can't okay. remember that part how does that work did dying get you into the Ark? Wow, you're definitely not from Theta. Let me guess, Omicron? Wasn't sure Catherine would be able to scan you guys. You're lucky. There was a lot of talk about this at Theta. The idea is, when you're activated in the Ark, there's basically two of you, right? One human, one living skin in the Ark. You don't want your copy to survive you. You yourself want to survive on the Ark. If the human you dies before the scan is initiated, or closely after, you yourself would live on in the Ark. Amazing, right? Hmm... Did Catherine put you up to this? Killing yourself? Catherine Chun? <laughs> no. I don't think you understand. She just did scans and put them into the Ark. I hope I get to meet her soon, so I can apologize. She always got into trouble with Strawmire when someone killed themselves. I think she's okay with it. Where is everyone? Man. Okay. I thought there would be like 40 or 50 people here. I don't know. Uh, I'll let you know if I see anyone. Um... <laughs> Clearly, Fortnite, the most culturally significant game of all time. It's funny, because, like, I assume you're joking there, but I could see an argument for it, right? Because that it actually has become a, hu a huge fucking game, right? And, like, super not joking? Okay. Yeah, because I can, I can totally see that, but it's like... Yeah, we don't have to like it. That's exactly. That's exactly what I was thinking. Like, it, just because it's not our game doesn't mean it wasn't significant. But like, the first games that we came up that we were brainstorming storming about were like the Mario series, um, even like Dark Souls. How Dark Souls became this uh, this concept beyond the actual gameplay that it was where people can describe a platformer as Dark Souls like, right? And we know what kind of what they're talking about. Um or or even like Portal or Half-Life. There are just so many games. Uh, um, so what we did for, come on, yeah, there's so many different cultures. Yeah, there's so many different ways that the gaming industry has been at, impacted by, like, individual titles. Uh, maybe we're supposed to go this way, actually? Ah, there we go. Fortnite is the biggest pop culture game, whereas those other games influence their own microcultures. Definitely. So what we ended up doing for this presentation is rather than talking about one individual game, we talked about what makes a game influential. Um, which was which was cool. I mean, it was a little two-minute presentation, right? So we didn't talk about just one game where we're like, these kinds of things will make a game influential. It was fun. It was a good, like, brainstorm. I bet there's very few high schoolers who have even heard of Portal or Half-Life. I hope that's not true. Portal was, like... Man. 
like Half-Life was huge because it was one of the first games that really did like a, a strong physics based engine, right? And that's Oh, it's a weird sound. And now that's become the norm, right? It was just one of the first games to do it. And Portal was like one of the first to do a story-based puzzle game. Everything else had been more prominently puzzles, less story. Which now it's like, if you have a game without a story, then what's, what's the point? We did it! Oh, this looks like it's in better shape. Hello? Anyone there? Hello? Hello? The blood is a good indicator oh, that there are people here. Data. Oh man, every time the game loads, it lags hard. Val really set a new, um, uh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Yeah, Valve has, like, a lot of Valve titles have been really influential. Uh, so that didn't work. Let's try going up this way. Oh man, if high schoolers haven't heard of Portal, I'm gonna feel so fucking old. Which, like, isn't even fair. Like, Portal didn't even come out that long ago. Alright, these doors are both locked. Can't touch them. Let's try this one. Then we'll break the glass. Which it looks like it wants me to do. Yep, we're breaking glass. Alright. Give me this box. Give me this box. Gimme. Gimme, 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 gimme. What? We gotta get in there. Alright, we'll try the bigger box. Bigger box! Take two. Can we pick this up? Nope. Too big. Briefcase? Ah, there we go. We just needed a heavier box. Ha ha ha. Alright, well, I can't open the door from the other side. Why would we need to? It'd be silly. We got a perfectly good window. I'm trying to think of what the most impactful game for me has been. Not like my favorite game, but just like a game that really broadened my horizons about what a game could be. Most influential game of all time, though. It's like a doctorate level thesis. <laughs> it's just so subjective, right? It's like one person might say might say Portal, another might say Mario, and a third might say Fortnite, all for completely equally valid reasons. We're here. We're here. Okay, great. Time to hijack ourselves a submarine. There will be nothing stopping us when we have the done that. You guys sure have a lot of machines and vehicles down here. What makes this one so special? It's the only transport that can go into the abyss without cracking like a can of soup. If this is one of a kind, then how did they get the Ark down the abyss in the first place? That's a good question. I suppose they did it the hard way and just walked. Didn't realize that was an option. Kath, what's it like inside the Ark? Is it like a movie or virtual reality? No, of course not. It's, you know, like real life, but slightly better. Pleasant mm -hmm. temperature, clean air, good weather. So people in the Ark just walk around pretending it's the real world? You don't have to pretend. It's perfectly immersive. And it can just sustain itself? Yes. Attached to a probe fueled by solar panels, it can survive for thousands of years. That's amazing. Just thinking about the Earth being what it is and us setting out to save the final remains of humanity, it's... It's... Heroic. Uh, at least it feels worth doing. It almost seems pointless. Here we go. <laughs> the dumb bat. Oh, damn it. I knew it was too good to be true. What's wrong? It's... It, it's quarantined. Hold on. We need a security cipher. How bad is it? It's we don't write these things down type of bad. Maybe someone's still around who can tell us what it is. 
Hmm. Sure. Let's go with that. I'll just unlock the other doors for you so you can explore the station. All right. I hope there's no robots. It's easy to measure sales. Influence is much harder to measure. Yeah, for sure. Um, for me, it would just be like, how many games were like created due to this one game? So like, w one that I think of right off the bat would be like Rogue, Rogue Legacy, right? Because we have an entire genre that that people argue about of like rogue light versus rogue light rogue rogue like rogue light i don't even know what the difference is i use them interchangeably um but you know we're just by name comparing the game to another game similar to like souls like i guess but i feel like rogue is a bigger genre on its own Okay, so Theta, all systems operational. I keep doing that. Back, map, main level. Minus level one, minus level two. Oh Looks my like god, this place is huge. Downstairs. Why abandon the gate? In the habitat? That's so strange. I don't like this at all. Okay. Uh, light means you keep some progress after a run, uh, versus a fresh start each time. So Hades is a roguelike. Gotcha. Oh, okay. That makes sense. Cool. Oh, look at all these people that are dead or missing. Guests. All right. I hope that I don't really need this map. Because I am not going to remember this, but... You think KY defined that one for you? That sounds like something he would know. I feel like I've even asked or talked to him about that at some point. Do I take this with me? We need to find someone who knows the right. cipher. Nope. It's the only way to fire up the Dunbat. Speaking of rogue games, oh, can I go over here now? Uh, I've been playing FTL a lot. <laughs> I got to the third phase of the final boss uh, a couple of times now, and I've gotten really, really close. But I haven't beaten it yet. Uh, and as soon as I finish this game, I'm definitely going to stream more FTL. Um, because I really liked streaming it. And it's like all I'm thinking about the rest of the time, you know? So I might as well just keep streaming it. I could start another weird indie game, they but... Why all leave this floor? I don't get it either. It's like they all just cleared out. Always kind of shield away from defining... Uh, music and games by their genres, which I know is obtuse of you. I, I mean, I'm kind of the same way, to be honest, Aloof. I I don't really care so much if it's good. We'll go back there later. Um, What's so interesting downstairs? Just labs and offices. Maybe the shuttle station. Should we go check? Rather not. Got a uh, feeling about that. I guess it's one of those things that I feel like it doesn't matter all that much. But if everyone else thinks it matters a lot, then I I should reevaluate. And all the others, I suppose. You don't remember? My scan was the first. Had to test the scanner before I could start making promises. Troubleshoot. Error code. Unable to connect to mainframe reset router in the sublevel vault or contact maintenance. Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab. The scan room. What happened? 
Comrade killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool? What should I do? I'm gonna need to tell Strohmeyer. No, please! I'm so close. Strohmeyer's gonna shut down the art project. It's not my fault people keep killing themselves. <laughs> Catherine, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can sneak a 300-pound body out of the lab. I know. Catherine, are you okay? Not even close. God damn, can you imagine? Oh. You upload your brain into the Matrix, but your physical body stays behind and therefore a copy of your consciousness. And so you're just like the unlucky one that didn't get uploaded because you were already uploaded. That's so fucked. <laughs> ah, I see. I still what? like... Check the terminal. I just want to make sure. I still can't quite understand killing yourself afterwards, though. I, I guess if there's like... If the world is like in full apocalypse mode and you're gonna all die, it's like... You're just choosing your death rather than prolonging it. But also, like, there were a lot of people here. They could have, like, just kept a little community going for as long as they could have, I, I assume, you know? Are these all people scans? I wonder if it's possible to see your uploaded consciousness as yourself or if you immediately other it. Yeah, that is interesting. Would you still consider your physical form to be the primary you or would it be the version that was uploaded to the Matrix? Munchie. How did this... What is this? Kath, what is this? Why do you have a file of me? You are one of Dr. Munchie's templates. The legacy scan. I won't let me go over and click on them. Oh, there we go. Audio recordings. Oh, shit. Okay, that's it. Wow, that was fun. That's a relief. I'm still figuring this out, so... It's freaky. So many lights. What do we do now? Paul and I are going to run tests for a week or so, and then we'll work out a roadmap to your recovery. Well, I feel excited. Can't wait to get back to the living. Feel like your own personal experience of yourself wouldn't change? Yeah, I guess how could it, right? It'd be very easy to, to look at the other one and be like, that one's not real. That's the fake. But then what if you're a robot that then got downloaded? We've worked everything out. Everything is legal. Vouched for by Dr. Peak and Professor Wei. Oh, that's great news. No big change in medication. You'll be taking an aspirin every morning, but that's about it. Paul worked out a diet with some variations you should try out. You can continue doing physical therapy. Also, there's some extra cardio training every other day. Okay, getting complicated. Don't worry, it's really not. We're gonna keep an eye on you every week, so we'll cardio. be able to adjust the plan if needed. I started doing cardio at the end of my climbing uh, on my workout days, and it's like, it's a good way to round out the, the workout, but also not fun. Last recording. The model was sound. It should have worked. It's not your fault, David. I really wish things had turned out differently. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to save you. Hey, you got my brain on file. Maybe you can put it to some use. <laughs> yeah, who knows? You'd be okay with that? Using it for my research? Sure. It's like a part of me lives on or something. Like a donated organ. Oh, we signed up for you this. Know what sucks about dying? <laughs> what? The crash. 
everything up till now, the brain damage, you guys, everything, has made my life so much more real. I started thinking about all the things I was going to do. I'd never been more excited to be alive. All that hope, wasted. Dang, that's rough. Uh, so this is a subtle thing that I've noticed from uh, while we've been playing is that the voice logs, like the subtitles, they um, load at the same speed that they're being read, um, which I really like that detail because I hate when you get the subtitles and you can read the whole thing before hearing anything. Erase data. I'm not gonna erase anybody. I feel like that's more like murder in this case. All right, how can I go back? Do I have to go to the last one? Was this like the... How do I get out of here? Why can't, why can't I go back? It won't let me select the back button. Don't make me erase everything. Do I have to? Oh, there we go. Oh, I was worried. I really didn't want to erase anybody. Back? Oh, wait, no. What? That was just me clicking on... Fuck! Uh, all right. Sorry, guys. I feel worse about this than the robot. Is this bugged? Can I not go back? I'm so confused. What the fuck? Why can't I go back? Y'all, is my game bugged? Oh my He's god. Dead, the real Simon is dead. And I'm a replica of that scan Munchie did thinking he's Simon. What did you expect? I don't know. I, but I don't know what I was hoping for. An explanation? I don't know why apology. it wouldn't let me select the back button there. Uh, uh, I was sorry. hitting like every Not button. I, well, thanks, I guess. I deleted the file, so hopefully I'll be the last Simon to suffer through this place. Ready to move on? Yeah. Let's go. I guess, I mean, I guess it's good that they won't get loaded into a random, a random suit again, you know? That would be kind of shitty. This is how we came up? Okay. Sorry for that detour there. Welcome to my place. When I started the art project, I pretty much lived in this lab. Cozy. Fuck your shit, Catherine. <laughs> this is where I would store the ARC scans. Are they similar to my legacy file? No, yours is flatter, if that makes sense. Less dynamic. Thanks. That makes me feel much better. I wish I could fix that. Damaged. Damaged. Bust. Mm. 
broken. There's got to be one, right? Maybe we don't get it from here. Oh wait, there's one more. All right, these all seem like garbage. It's gonna be the same thing. What was that one up here? Nope. We probably have to go down to that dark, spooky area. It's unsettling. All right. Suppose we go down now. Simon, the last report filed by the staff mentioned struggling with something called a proxy. The proxy we killed was blind, just like Acres, but it listens. Careful, we spotted two more by the infirmary. What do they look like? Not sure. It seems to be human enough to pass for a crew member at a distance. Tall, dark, and ultimately fossil seems to be what we have for. Keep my eyes open. Did you guys see me jump there? <laughs> I fully jumped. Oh, well, that's not great. The legacy scan of me that was on the computer. What did you use it for? It's a template that has an intelligence pathwork already etched into the base. So, if I wanted to build an AI, I wouldn't have to reinvent a whole model. I would be able to focus on the things that the AI is to be used for. Is every AI self-aware? Do they also think they're Simon? What? No, Simon. Don't worry. It's not like we just put people into robots and let them run free. That'd be really cruel. It doesn't work like that. Or at least it didn't used to work like that. It didn't Truly used to. Machines. Thinking they are people is definitely new. But you kept them sentient for the Ark. Yes, and I basically had to invent the method. I can hear Harvey out in the hallway just meowing. And uh, he is not coming back in. I can also see that we can open those stalls and I'm not doing it because there will be a jump scare I'm sure we went down so that way right you're not worried that there are other Simons yeah and Catherine's running around out there now I am Gee, Simon some thoughts are better left alone Hi, Conrad Cool safety. Don't look into emit emitter. Microwave radiation. I uh, I just finished rewatching. What the real Simon would have thought if he knew about me? What do you mean? You do know about yourself. No, I I mean the real Simon, the human Simon. Going by your reactions, I'd say you'd be pretty upset. Um, just finished rewatching Chernobyl on HBO, and that is 
a wild ride that I highly recommend. Lou, if you gotta hit the hay, thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. I hope it wasn't because of the, the joke that I made in your stream the other day. <laughs> but I'm always glad to see you here. And I'm glad that you're back streaming. I missed your streams a lot. I'm really stuck on that one. I'm just worried about my colleagues. Of course not. Okay. <laughs> cool. Uh, I want to... There we go. Well, have a good night. Take it easy. I'll see you soon, I'm sure. Dear friends, when you read this, I will have entered the Ark. As I've explained this... Uh, as I've explained this accomplishment by ceasing to live as your scan is being completed. As your scan is... Yeah, is being completed. Uh, to not frighten Catherine, I will do this in secret by folding cyanide salts into chewing gum and placing it in my mouth before seeing her. When I hear her announce completion, I will bite down, quickly causing my own demise. Jesus Christ, what an asshole! <laughs> when you discover the truth behind my death, know there is no tragedy to mourn, for I am victorious. I advise you all do the same and join me inside the Ark. Sincerely, Mark. So, the other thing that's weird here is, like, these people could live on eternally right in the ark however because of the immediate selfishness to just die as soon as you're on the ark there's like no guarantee that the ark gets sent up into space where it can you know live on what does it mean to be human does your body or your surroundings confine or define you all very difficult ideas to approach without having to question your invalidated by the practical or mystified by the spiritual minded a little apropos martin fisher Could you not? Come here. I dislike the noises. Oh, the cat. This guy left his cat. What a monster. We're all dying anyways. I'm all in. I put my faith in Sarang and the continuity. Y'all. Just, man, can you imagine, like, you're a doctor, right? And you're doing an MRI for someone, and as soon as it's done, they just, like kill themselves in front of you because they're like, oh, you know, the work's done. That's the same picture. Okay. They really wanted to make sure I saw it. Oh, this one? I don't think we need any of this brain juice. I think we're alright. I think I'll close it. Is it coming this way? Do we need to get it to, like, open the door or something? Oh, it's glass. So maybe we actually just can't go that way? Oh, Catherine. How did we miss this? Hey, there's a 
that's my room. You want me to bring something? A souvenir? No, it's just memories. Little doll. Journal. Oh, we're gonna read her diary. Imogen Reed tested a machine today. It was clearly corrupted by WoW, but more importantly, it was assembled in a seemingly primitive way, like someone had specifically created it for WoW to steal. When activated, the machine mimicked the sound and read along with it. At some point, she was scanned and then loaded as simulation inside the digital space. The presentation shocked Reed and was quickly terminated. It scares me how much it reminds me of my AR capsule. That could be a cool mechanic if you had to lure the monster to open the door for you and then escape before it got through. Uh, yeah, that's 100% what I thought I was supposed to do because I know that that's a mechanic in Amnesia, right? I, I remember having to do that once or twice. Not like through the door, but like had to lure it from one area to the next so that you could get through, you know? Uh, after dissecting the Vivarium machine that Reed activated, it's clear that WoW copied my capsule project to construct the scene to hold the Reed simulation. It's actually very similar, similar in its construction except for one point, where my capsule houses flat people constructed from model neurographs. The Vivarium's brain scan lives on. It isn't limited by its content. From originating brain scan, read emerged. The read inside the Vivarium was a perfect copy. You gotta play Amnesia. So, like, Amnesia, I think it holds up pretty well. I just watched um, uh, our, our good friend of the stream, Dave, uh, play Amnesia for the first time. And I'll say the... the, the last like third of the game gets pretty buggy or at least it, it gets um it's not obvious like what you have to do which isn't ideal um but like it's one of the first of its kind in terms of like true horror games like psychological horror games so it's worth playing it if you like that kind of stuff um this is a better story for sure the first one is more spooky I think. I have it. I can save humanity. I can build an artificial reality capsule that can hold every living member of Pathos 2. I can't figure out how it worked with uh, the Vivarium, but I can replicate WoW's scanning technique using the pilot seats. They are already prepared with the type of electromagnetic drums needed. It was even easier than I thought. The pilot seats are already set to lure the dif uh, differaction and high energy needed to capture the scan. I suspect WoW has been using the seat to steal scans from us for a while. I guess that explains the Mockingbirds. The WoW must have stolen scans from people using the pilot seat and used it as a basis for intelligence in the machines. Oh, interesting. So the, are those the things that are chasing us is like a corrupted human persona. That's weird. With a surprisingly positive reaction from the team, we now officially started the ARC project. We are to scan all people we can find and load them into the capsule. When we launch it into space using the space gun, uh, it's nice to think something will live on like that. Mark Sarang killed himself after his scan. He's been suggesting everyone kill themselves as it would somehow allow them to actually get on the ARC. I'm not sure how that would work. It did trigger a lot of arguments among staff and apparently it's my fault somehow. Uh, Strom Stromier is not happy with me. I hope it will calm down. AR capsule. Richard gave me a seed of the AI templates I haven't been I haven't seen before. Unfolded one of them to make a, a new friend for capsule Catherine and her gang gang of legacies. New way to simulate turbulence makes the weather seem so much better. Implemented Reed didn't go well. Uh, new try with Reed. Reed won't play nicely with the others. She's too real. Interesting. Okay. Anything else I can do in here? Guess not. I still... I still don't think that this door was... Did this... No, okay. I don't think that that door was unlocked the first time we came down here, because I think I would have noticed it. I was, like, really meticulous about going through all the doors in order. All 
All right, so we've gone through here. I don't think there's anywhere around here we, we can actually go. And we can't go up. I could try again to get through that door at the end. Maybe if I break it, break the glass somehow. It didn't have a crack in it, but we could try it. Maybe not. No. Okay. I'll go back. Not sure how much longer I'm going to play tonight. I feel like we made really good progress. At least. Go back up here for a second. There was a map around here somewhere, I thought. Or I recall. It goes further back, though. Oh, hey, shit. How, how did I miss that? An intact memory chip. If we're lucky, we might be able to extract the cipher from it. Hey. Cool. What do I do with it? Where does it go? Does it go in here? Do we do this already? Uh, Strasky, come in. I need help in the lab, the scan room. What happened? Conrad killed himself after the scan. Jesus, how? Um, laser tool. Yeah, we, we did hear this one. Where do I put the chip? Where do I put the chip? <gasps> Lights! <laughs> Heck yeah. Can we put the chip in the robot? Maybe we have to uh, trouble, we have to fix the computer first. So we have to go down to the sub-level vault, I guess. All right. Sub-level vault, here we come. Light there. Oh. Yeah, all right. Found it. interested in this as just like you know a thing or a place I'm less happy to be here than I was upstairs saving we've got three doors let's do these in order excellent Excellent. We're back in Spooktown. And I I don't recall any of this for the record. Please don't jump scare me. 
Oh, I can't, like, talk to you or interact with you at all. You're alive, too. It's shitty. Anything we can do with these servers? I don't think so. I just noticed that, like, my breathing got really shallow. <laughs> Take a couple deep breaths. Alright, so we've gone through three doors. For some reason, I think we're gonna have to go through the fourth door. hear it. Man, these people are having rough days. Oh, there it is. Oh my god, that one doesn't have lights? That's not fair. I wonder if it can see light. You know what? I'm gonna leave my flashlight on and just, like, see if it spots me with it. Because, like, not having a flashlight in here sucks. I also have no idea what I'm looking for. Just stay in the corner. Just look down. Just look down. They won't notice me. Go right by me, man. I'm just hiding in the corner. You can't see me. You can't see me. It can see me. All right. It can see me. Noted. All right. Oh, wow. I'm like... Super dark and dizzy. Oh, that looks like where I'm supposed to be. Okay. Let's just go straight there. Just keep moving. Stay out of its path and keep moving. fuck is the router? Is this not where I'm supposed to be? Because that would suck. Is that the- wait, do I have to hit this button? I want to make sure I exhaust all options before I leave here. Going, man. Hell yeah. Flip switch to confirm reset. There we go. I 
think we're done, but I do kind of want to check it one more time before we leave. I think we're good. We can just go. Let's just be really sneaky. Probably gonna walk straight into it. I'm pretty sure the entrance was this way. Oh, heck yeah. I forget if we needed to come back to any of these. I don't think there was anything to do in there. That was a dead end. We're leaving. How do I get up? Actually shocked it let me leave this area without a full on uh good chase scene. This better have worked. Down there again. Oh that was scary, but it wasn't too bad. It was it was it wasn't too bad. That could have been worse. Try running a simulation from the chip you found. Someone must know the cipher. Yeah, all right, so do we go back to the chair then? Dear Lord. I like forget everything that we have done. Because that was just so tense. And this wobbly. Oh, yes. Please. No. Rose. All right, all right. What the hell are you doing? I know it looks bad, but it makes me feel a lot better. It helps me focus. That's... I mean, that's the wow you're hooking up to. I need it, okay? I wouldn't have made it this far without it. Let's just keep going. We're hooking up to the wow. We're giving ourselves cancer. All right, so we're back in the chair room. Okay. Restricted file. Where do we put the uh, chip now? We have the chip. We've restarted all the computers. Let's try this room. Go ahead. Plug in that chip you found. Ah, there we go. Insert a chip. Aha! We did it! There should be a list of people. 
See if there's anyone who could know a security cipher. Oh, Raph. From Greenland. Three milliseconds? She said she'd help out delivering the Ark. Killed himself because of continuity. Schremeyer's really mad, has tightened security. I wish it said, like, what he did. Delta refugee, construct wrang construct wrangler. He's working for Stromir now. Maybe him. Brandon. Another continuity suicide. We look so much alike in a different life. I'm sure we'd be best friends. He helped me out. Uh, she helped me cut the wavelength from the helmet. If anything, it should make post-scan hangover less severe. Sounds like she might know something. Heather. Brasky was cheerful and funny as always. She said she'd help construct the arc but not carry it to, fit, to Fi. Let's start with Brandon. Very promising. I'll just load him up and get the simulator going. There we are. What are we doing exactly? We're gonna have a talk with Mr. Wan. Use the computer to activate the simulation. That wasn't so bad. This room I really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened to I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wan. It'll all get better. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Mr. Wan, I need you to stay calm. No, 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 no. Well, why, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! Did we just bring that guy to life? I mean, he's a perfect scan, meant for the Ark. He's the real deal. And we turned him off. Took it all away again. I mean, he was having a panic attack. Work. Maybe we can try again. Option? We can't do any options. I mean, it's just gonna do the same thing, right? That wasn't so bad. Stroma really got me worked up, bastard. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Mr. Wan. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that's, that's a lie. You're lying. Don't get upset, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why, are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! This setup won't work. We need something else. Okay. What do we need? The cyber. We just need the cyber. What? What happened? Where did everyone go? Take it easy, Mr. Wong. Chun? What happened? I, I can't see anything. There's nothing here. Don't worry, Mr. Wong. It'll all get better. No, no, that, that's all. Wait! Simon, you just reset the simulation. What? You want me to do it again? So bad. Stroma really got me worked up, bastard. What? Seems mean. <laughs> what happened? Where did everyone go? Don't be afraid. Chun? What happened? I, I I can't see anything. There's nothing here. It's okay. It's all a part of the scam. No, no, that's that's a lie. You're lying. Okay, calm down, Mr. Wan. No, 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 no. Well, why are you, why are you doing this to me? I trusted you, Chun. I trusted you! Yeah, this is just all Simon, the same. we need something new to work with. 
All right, Catherine, I'm open to ideas. Simulation assets. What? Where does this go? Where do I put this? Wait, oh, oh, I thought that was a camera. <laughs> I thought that was like a webcam on the desk. Loading environment data. Loading scan data. Ah, We can put him in a ski lodge. That's not gonna be weird at all. That wasn't so bad. This robot really got me worked up, bastard. What? How did I get here? Don't be afraid, Mr. Wan. Dr. Chun, is that you? What happened? What is this place? Everything's fine. Theta needs your help. We need the new security cipher. Dr. Chun? I hear your voice, but there's no one here. There's no one here! It's empty. It's too empty. There's something really wrong with this place. It's not real! This isn't real! I have to get out of here! Okay, so... Do we need to turn it off? Can we just keep him alive until we've got the cipher? The longer he's exposed to the computer model, the more he'll get hung up on it. So, what's wrong with letting him settle in a little? It would drive him insane. So let's keep the session short and the suffering to a minimum. So we'll try the ski lodge. Because <laughs> if that's any less weird. What? What is this? Where am I? Relax, Mr. Wan. Just keep calm. Dr. Chun? What the hell is this place? Ski I lodge time. I need to know what the new security cipher is. Why are you doing this? Is this some trick? I'm not giving you anything. It's not for me. I'm trying to save the Ark. No, you're lying. This is all a lie. Look at this place. It's a fucking joke. Get me out of here, Chunter. I'll punch your teeth in. I think we need to build the scene so it's more what he'd expect. As soon as he starts to doubt, we've lost him. You're right. We need to think this through. We need some more data. Uh, cool. So we need another... We need a, an asset of just the room that we're already in. Or the scanning room, I suppose. Scan room. Test environment. Scan room! Transfer denied. Restricted file. What? Can we bring the thing over here and plug it in on this side? We sure can! Haha, <laughs> with that webcam looking thing. I got it. I figured it out. I figured out the puzzle. Wasn't much of a puzzle, but I figured it out. Alright, we go back over here. Plug this in. Excellent. What do you mean? Oh, copy to chip. Ha <laughs> I can read. <laughs> okay. I was like, why can't we do these other ones? Ha 
Haha, <laughs> got the chip. Take two. Loading. All right, all right. Scan room. Run. That wasn't so bad. Stromar really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Congratulations, Mr. Wan. The scan was successful. Chun? Where's Alice? She left. Mr. Wan, I need you to give me the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? This is a trick. Please, this is important. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! How many times are we gonna have to do this? Come on, Simon. Don't give up now. We have all the right pieces. We just need Catherine to so say bad. the right thing. Stroma really got me worked up, bastard. What? Where did it? Alice? Mr. Wan, can you hear me? Chun? Where's Alice? She's fine. We don't have much time, Mr. Wan. I need the new security cipher. What? Why? Why would you need that? We need to not this lead with that. Please calm down. I knew you couldn't be trusted. None of this is real. But you won't break me, Wow. You hear me? You won't break me! Can't keep trying the same thing over and over. We sure can. I feel like we have all the... Oh, is, do we need another module now or something? All right. Let's take this. No, let's take both of them in case we need either one. Give me this. Can we put a purse one of the one of the people on here? No. This one's already We tried this one. But we can't copy these, right? There are different scan option. Because these, we just, we deleted everybody. Okay. Man, I must have been hitting the wrong button when I was over here at some point. This looks like somewhere I could put the thing, but it's not powered. Can I switch putting in the chip or the other thing? Hmm. I don't really want to go to a different area, but we could look around a little bit more. I don't think there was anything in here. Maybe in here. This area still makes me nervous. I wish I knew Brandon better. What would make him talk? Oh, we could go check out his room. Here we go. Brandon Wan's room. I'll just override the lock for you. Nice. If we get to know him, maybe we can make the simulation a little smoother. Brandon, you ready to go? Strohmeyer says it's time to move. I'm waiting for Straskin. I'll borrow to pack up their stuff. Head downstairs, and I'll meet you there. 
Don't take too long. Don't worry, we're right behind you. Seems like they were getting ready to leave. Heard some lady telling Brandon to hurry up. You got that from the intercom? Must be a transmission buffer. Hang on. That's Alice Coster. Wouldn't have guessed they even knew of each other. Interesting. Cute. August 14th. Akers finally agreed to evacuate Delta. Goya, Kier, and I moved to Theta today. Akers said he's, uh, he'd stick around for a while longer, crazy bastard. I take pride in my work, but goddamn, the place is miserable since the surface stopped sending parts. Did my ARK scan together with Alice, Strodemeyer like told me. Did their scans together. Oh, we can definitely use that. I think uh, we got this, Simon. I can synthesize Alice's voice from the intercom and use it to impersonate her for the simulation. We can trick him into feeling safe enough to open up. Great. Definitely feeling good about this. <laughs> good job with the intercom. I didn't know you could data mine. What's it like? It's just something that I do now. <laughs> so it comes naturally to you. That's really interesting. Yeah, I'll make sure to add it to my dating profile. Uh, I was fine at first, but I got a splitting headache a couple of hours later. The biggest pain was that Chun was that Chun girl. She's so fucking uncomfortable at all times, it makes my skin crawl. Schrodemeyer went ballistic and shut down all future scans for the ARC project. Apparently, Conrad wanted in on one of the continuity and just fried himself right in the pilot seat after the scan. Something tells me we'll be getting new security ciphers. I just heard that camaraderie uh, survey team is going to Delta to pick up a Acres. He's been alone for months. Can't imagine what he's been up to. Oh, he's having the time of his life becoming a chess master over there. Alright. Alright, we got what we need. That room still freaks me out. I wonder if you don't use any of those little goop things. Uh, if the it stays lighter in the area. So now maybe it'll let us copy her her thing. Oh, she's not here though. Okay. I thought I'd have to copy her mind or something. I compiled an Alice module that we can use. So she'll be with Brandon in the simulation. Sort of. I'll still need to do the talking, but it'll sound and look like Alice. I still don't think that'll work, but... That's all the options. That wasn't so bad. Stroma really got me worked up. Bastard. Oh, it loaded her in. Okay, well, not just a voice. I guess I had it coming. About Stroma. He said he needed a new cipher ASAP. What should I tell him? It's alright. I can talk to him. Wait. Didn't Sean just tell you to take it easy? Don't worry, I'm not going to tell anyone. I do feel hungover. Okay. It's 1729 over 42, 12 over 407. Got it? Yeah, I got it. I'm sorry, Mr. Long. Brandon. Goodbye. What do you mean? No, wait. That's enough. We got what we need. Is that what we are? Simulations? Yeah, but it shouldn't make any difference. You're still you. I'm not sure what to do with the data. You decide. I still don't like that we erased the other data, so I'm gonna... I'm gonna just shut down. Although it'll suck if he gets woken up by a robot in this same place, but you know what? It's too late. So we got the security cipher. And I think that means we can go back. Simon, we got it. We can get to the dumbat now. Get back here. I've heard something. I heard noise. OK, 
Catherine, couldn't we just have extracted the cipher from Brandon's data somehow? It's cruel bringing him back like we did. No, that's impossible. Memories don't work like that. Let's just hope it was worth it. All right, let's check in with Catherine, and then I'm probably going to call it for the night. Probably. There you are. Just warming up the Dunbat for us. It's been collecting dust for months, so it might need a minute. Okay, that's it. That's everything. Let's go ahead and... Huh. That's weird. Huh. Never mind. What do you need me to do? Head inside the dock. The Omnitool can open the door now. And get into the Dunbat. Then plug me in, and I'll take us into the Abyss. Sounds easy enough. Alright, um... That seems like a good spot to leave off on, so I think I'm going to pause the game and I'm going to set up a raid. If you stick around for the raid, you'll get channel points that you can use to make me play games like getting over it. Um, maybe other varieties of games in the future. We'll see. But uh, thank you all for hanging out. Arco, good to see you. Loof, I know you took off earlier, but thanks for hanging out. Allie. We had Bridge in here. We had a bunch of people. Orc. Yeah. What a nice group. All right. So let's set up a raid.